All right, guys, KB32 here. Check it out. So we're sitting over here in the Freedom Office. I was getting ready to do a video talking about that fiasco up in New York where they decided unilaterally that uh, they're just going to take all our rights away. You can't carry a gun anywhere unless it says you can carry a gun, which uh, there was a judge that put a uh, stop, what do you call that, stop order on that. But then all of a sudden the appeals court went in and said, no, you can do that. So now they're going to be putting together a new bill. Uh, anyway, long story short, Hopefully the New Yorkans can get their shit together and figure this thing out by uh, voting that Hochul lady out of office. So anyway, I decided to go ahead and do a real quick video on this uh, one of the stages at the uh, Memorial 3 gun. Now, if you're not familiar with Memorial 3 gun, it was to memorialize the uh, lives of 10 individuals who died either in the line of duty and I, I, one was tragically killed by trying to save his two daughters in a fire. That's a heartbreaker. So in any case, uh, this is a really cool stage where we had to start off with shotgun and holster the pistol, uh, what they call aircraft ready, without anything in the chamber or a mag in. Uh, I elected not to put a mag in because if the pistol comes off of you, it's a long story short. Didn't want to go that way. I could charge it when I get down, insert a mag. Uh, so you start off a shotgun and then you had to jump into the passenger seat of a Jeep Cherokee. And I'm talking about one of the little itty bitty Jeep Cherokees. So for a big boy like me, I'm 6'2", and uh, it was a lot of fun. Uh, I did have a failure uh, malfunction in the rifle, but we were able to quickly adjust from that, get it going back up and running. And uh, then you transitioned over out of the vehicle, uh, hitting two Sammies, then some targets, swingers, and then a side target goes like this. So you have to hit it like that. Did pretty good on this thing. I think overall I was in the uh, about the low 70s out of 262 shooters. So with that being said, here's the stage. Oh, but before we go, RTS Tactical, you got a link on my YouTube channel or my, my website, uh, kb32tag.com. They've got a new gig and I cannot wait to take this thing out and test it because I thought they were crazy when they said they had this. But ladies and gentlemen, this <laughs> is a bulletproof pillow. And I'm going to tell you something, it's actually soft, it has a panel inside of it, and uh, we're going to take it out and shoot it up, see what that does, but it's got straps on the back of it right here, so you can hold it like this, and do your thing in the middle of the night, if somebody tries to come in your house. Is this something for everybody? I don't know, man, but isn't that cool? It also has a pillow cover, this is really soft, and, mm, it's called, this is uh, the bamboo shade. So there is a link to RTS Tactical on KB32Tag.com. This, <laughs> I'm pretty impressed. So anyway, let's get to it. Man, this is the third stage, or the last stage of the uh, Memorial 3-Gun for me. Yeah, Y'all probably not going to put up a lot more, but I am going to go out to Carolina 3-Gun a couple times in the next upcoming months to have some fun. Uh, with that being said, we always end them like this. God bless America. God bless us men, women in uniform, 24-7 for our freedom, because freedom is not free. KB32, I'm out of here. Y'all be good. Boom. <laughs>
Clear. Good push clear. Range is clear, reset! One, zero, six, five, two! Malfunctions. One, zero, six, one five, two. First one of the event. You also dropped a pistol mag back there, and you yeah. ended perfectly on no round. Well, he's got one on his belt. Too. Oh, yeah. Okay, good. <laughs> yeah, I saw when you were dragging Randy, you dropped a mag right by his head between the trunk, and I was like, that's I hope it's stage three. Yeah. I'm always trying to